Hi everyone, welcome to Greg's workshop again on doing the forge. I thought I had this camera going, but I've been on it for about three hours, maybe four hours, and the camera is gone. So, what I've been doing is making this thing. This is the back door. I'm just going to put this thing on first. I'm going to do a little bit of grinding in a minute and make up this other crap. No. Hope everyone's looking after themselves. Being good. I went out yesterday for the first time in about a week, fortnight. So had to go and put some money in my credit card. And, and <laughs> I'm taking cash money. I had to laugh. Me and myself went into EB Games. Right. He went into EB Games, right, to get a, a game. He got the game, walked over, pulled out a wallet full of cash. Because no one's taking cash, right? Well, some people are. I'm going to finish this and get it done. And where's my glove? Where's my freaking glove gone? I'm not bloody hitting it. What a bummer. Glove run away. Oh, I don't know where it went. Here, glovey, glovey, glove. Where'd you go? Mangle! Well, I'll go on you without it. Well, it's going to get a bit noisy, everyone. And then I'm going to show you what I've got to do with this. I'll wait for a second. Mongrel glove run away to. Hey, it must have wanted a holiday. 
I wish I could have went. Right. Now, we've got some front door pieces to put fat catch up. Now, I don't know which is which here. Side back. Right, put that over here. We'll put that up. This one. I take it that is a side. A side. And back and back. Make that square to a hit. Right. We'll put that one away. One from. Right. Put a little twinkie toes up there. You get the T8 meter. It should be 25.2, 26, 27, 27, exactly. Right, everyone. Yeah, I um, had a bit of an accident yesterday. It was a beauty too, frightening the living crap out of me. I thought I had no finger. No finger from this finger. I got whacked with a grinding disc. I'll show you a hole in where it broke up into the toolbox up there. It broke a hole right through that big toolbox. Oh. The whole uh, the glove didn't want to go there much all day. Right, I'll show you. See the big hole? From over there, hit my finger, ripped off and come up and smashed into that toolbox. Right. And then he's bloody killed. You can see me, but I'm gonna wind it up a bit. I'm, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna cut a little bit of steel in a minute with the bandsaw, which will take about all of about a few minutes. What happened with the day? I cut it too short. Not watching what I was doing. Get right on the button. <coughs> Relying on the measurements that I made because of my dyslexic crap. Seen it work since I've had it finished. Hey, right. get a little bit of origami going here. A little bit of a love tap winder in a bit. All right, we've got record there. We do is press the button, run the coolant, and he can run the flat out. And this is the best money I ever spent. He bounces a bit. 
I don't know, I've got to take it off and tighten up the back wheel, I think. It's a bit of a wobble. And I'm rather happy with it. Hasn't let me down, it works fine. Since I put the fill on, I have not broke one blade. There we go, she fully stops. Except for the coolant. Got to turn that off. I think people watch this to see how it was going to turn out. But at that beginning, I've went and seen it. I'm not sure. Right. I'll put you back over there. On the, on the shoulder here. Bad week, I think. I tried to get some cut hats going, a bit more hats and stuff to choose for teaching on. But um, I said, I don't know if ever anyone does. I'd go so far. I don't like losing money. with it, it's turned out really good. I've ordered the um, factory stuff, the mix it with water, it's 300 degrees, 3,600 degrees stuff, <coughs> 25 kilos of it. This has only got a seven inch hole, a seven inch by a seven inch square hole. This this is a back reader. Where something comes through, you want to stick it out the back. Not nothing really big. I'm not made it for big stuff. I can have long stuff, big round stuff can go on the front. But the seven inch square, that's a big chunk of fucking metal. <coughs> um, yeah. I put in um, I left seven hours yesterday. I went and got me bricks, me heat bricks. That was a chore. Went to one place, rung them up before I left. You got this, that, yada, 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 heat bricks, yep. The 2600, yep, yep. Two packets, two boxes. That'll cost you $76 a box. All right, be down and pick them up. Went to pick them up. He went up, he didn't even, didn't even remember the order. Didn't even put it up. So I got there, which is an hour drive down the highway to get to it. And then an hour back. I'm getting close to half past four, half past five. I whiz out to Bunnings out here, from where I live. And they got 12 boxes. And they said they didn't have any. So I don't know what I don't believe anymore. I said, this distancing shit's getting a bit rough. I said, I was in the shop and I'm standing a good distance away from this guy. I'm probably six feet away from him, six or seven feet. And I've got a woman standing right behind me. If I step back any further, I would have pushed her through a bench. And he's going, be back, mate. Stand back, you're getting too close. And I call him an idiot. See this lady behind me, if I go back any further, mate, I'm going to knock her over. I'm not allowed to come close to you. Will you come out here and you load my stuff on the bench then? I'll move over here. And I walked over there, he'd come out from behind the counter and pick my stuff up and put it on the counter. I said, no, you either come around and pick it up or I just walk out and you can stick it up your ass. And he, and he said, everyone's done the main just standing there looking at him, giving him the dirtiest look out. And I said, mate, you're going a bit far with the social distancing. 
I should be more wary of you getting it off of you. Because this is the first time I've been here in years. And the first time I've been out of the house in weeks. Out of my workshop, I haven't been here any. I got all my stuff on orders. I ordered me a heat proof mat. It's a um, half inch thick one, which is 3,600 3, per sheet. So the bloke said if you put a, put two or three together, you'll end up with nine, 10,000 heat degrees. Yeah, and he said, you don't have to put bricks in it. You can just put this in there, mate, and put the fractory over the top. Yeah, but I want the heat bricks to give it a bit of strength on the base and on the sides and on the top. I don't want nothing banging up there and breaking. trying to get a hold of um, some more hats to my collection, but um, I can only pay through PayPal. I won't use my credit card anywhere else over the, it's only through PayPal, and because I've been stung a few times, once before. I've ordered something paid for it and I've never got it. I still to this day, I've never got it. I had the bank go after them, they told me to go whistle Dixie. Well, their bank, they, they touched their money in their bank, they'd sell them. For stealing money out of their account. Well, all right, they'd steal it out of mine. And the bank wouldn't go any further with it. Yeah, no. So how's everybody started their Easter day? We, we were told we can't do anything. We were supposed to be staying home all Easter. No fishing, no, no going out doing anything. Yeah, I did finish my bee roller. It's up there, all ready to go. Got the crown of thorns on it, she's working properly. Okay, the second. Um, I better turn this welder off. It's hot. Uh, 24 in here today. When I'm sweating from working, this took me a while. Be nice and clean. Got some good welds on. I didn't weld the top on the inside. I don't think there's any need. I welded the sides because there was a big hole, big gap between where it, where it come through. The well was on this on this side as well, so I burned it over to cover it. This up here wasn't quite near the same, but it's um that's five mil steel. There's forty dollar piece of steel there. I said, talking the price. I bought um, seven pieces, 120 by 13, 13 inches long by um, 120 in metric is um, 1200 and the other is, where is it, 13, 4, 8, 16. 430, 430, wide, 430, I think it is. Uh, 430 that, that way, 13 inches this way. 413, 413, 430. These are 13 inches square. The back ones are 13 inches square. Front ones, top ones 13 inches by 19 inches. Bottom ones 13 inches by 19 inches. And the other two there are uh, back door and front door. That's the front door, that's the back door. There's four sides and two backs, two fronts, the front and the backs. Yeah, so. I'm going to 
matte black. It's going to be a matte black finish. Got to have some big hinges on it, so I take the weight and probably open up this high off and right around. It'll go right around to the side of the right like this and it'll tip like this. Probably. And the hinge will come back and come down and close and go right on the button, come down and close right on the button. So it shuts the flash flush. And when I put the factory in, the factory will, the, the factory and stuff will sit on here. But I will put it on a flat piece of steel just like that. So it's bonds flat surface all the way through. So when you close it, it's got an airtight seal. <coughs> I'll just put some more stuff in there if I got it. Oh, I hope so. Um, yeah, uh, what else can I say? Um, uh, to all my new subscribers, thank you. I, um, I haven't been able to get back to um, I've had a lot of catching up to do. Um, last night I was up until five this morning. I said oh, I've only just come out to go to work today and I'm already tired. I woke up at 7.30. I was out of bed at 8. 8.30, walked around, had a cup of coffee, got about three or four cups of coffee, then got up, got dressed. Um, Anime PJs and sat inside for a little while, had some lunch, checked up on some of the delivery times on me stuff. They give you direct delivery times now, they are travelling very quickly. I said I got some masks, they had to postpone them because they come from somewhere where I didn't think they come from. And China stuff won't get through. So I've had to go and have another think. friends or to other YouTube members. Send it around the world, mate. The more help that I can get, the better. I'm thinking about having a giveaway on me, um, on a thousand subscribers so I can change this thing around a bit. don't know yet. Might have a t-shirt, might have a, um, a hat, some hats of mine, t-shirt, uh, and some stickers. Might be giveaway stickers. I don't know. Yeah. I'll have to see. help me. Well, I just don't know what to say anymore. I can't find out which one it was on YouTube. On um, Facebook. How can we help? We can donate or support the channel. I haven't got any merch store up or nothing yet, but Yeah. 
now, Stacy. I'm going to turn this stuff off and go to bed. I'll go up and have some tea and then go to bed. Alright, I'm going to and leave this. I'll catch you on the flip side. And tomorrow, I'll, tonight I'll put this one up. I'll be putting one up every two days of this build. This one will be, the next one will be of the front door. And that'll go right through to the... Then I'll put the base down, back door, up, do the front door and everything. I've got to go buy hinges tomorrow. I'll make all of them up. And should have it all ready by then. All right, everyone. Got to go. Bye.